PIMSEED is a delightful tool. It connects building information models to your existing Excel calculations, which you already know how to use. However, like any tools, it does have its limitations. My name is Sakari Lehtinen. Welcome. In this PIMSEED tutorial, you will learn what the current limitations and restrictions are. First restriction you probably notice is that we didn't implement the whole Excel application inside Simple PIM. Obviously. In fact, only the very minimum. Over the years, Excel has grown into a versatile but also a very complex tool. There are thousands of features. The idea in PIMSheet is that you create your Excel workbook in the actual Excel application with its amazing features. And then you bring it to Simple PIM and to PIMSheet palette. In the PIMSheet, you connect the model data to your calculations and visualize the data with the model. But any more enhanced edits you must do in the Excel application. There are some formatting options here, as you can see. You can make single references with your mouse, but not yet ranges or use this technique in more complex formulas. You can of course write the references and formulas. The good news is that BIMSEED palette is very good at preserving even all the fancy Excel stuff, even though it cannot show them. For example, you may have charts in your original Excel workbook. At the moment they are not shown in BIMSEED palette, but when you save your BIMSEED back to Excel file, the charts are preserved. If you open the file in the Excel application, you can see the charts are there. And that they work with the data that came from the model, which is brilliant. Same applies to most of the Excel's features. If you found something very special that is lost in the process, please let us know. One of the most exciting features in BIMSEED is the visualization. The fact that you can visualize your original calculations with BIM is a groundbreaking possibility. However, that too has its limits. In the current PIMSheet version, you can only visualize so-called unconditional references. Meaning that if there are conditional logic in your formulas, then the visualization doesn't work. The most popular example of this is probably some ifs and count ifs. If you are using these in your formulas, then at the moment PIMSheet unfortunately cannot find the related model objects. Then again, otherwise the formulas can be as complex as needed and still the references to the model are found even if the model data is behind multiple steps. PIMSEED is a magical tool, but it can only be as magical as the model data. This isn't restriction of the actual tool rather than BIM itself. If the model data doesn't fit for your purpose and meet your requirements, then the whole thing doesn't work. The good news again is that PIMSEED works inside Simple BIM. Simple BIM has top of the line tools for preparing your model to fit for your purpose and your calculations. You simply have to learn how to use these tools and your BIMSEED will work in every project and with every model update. BIMSEED is in active development. We are already working on removing some of these known restrictions. Please send us comments and feedback so that we can make BIMSEED the best possible tool for you. Thank you for watching. See you next time.